Tonight marked the third game on the Cornell men's basketball schedule. It's still early November, but a loss could send the Big Red to seeing red. Binghamton an easy opponent on paper, but what about on the court? The upset alert on high. Cornell on fire again early, and Devin Cherry with the steal here. He throws it down. Big Red up 12 in the first. Cornell's Dion Giddens goes up and gets this one here. Cornell on a roll early. And it's 19-6. BU trails by 13 at the break. In the second, Dominic Schlefko spots Giddens again. And Big Red cruising up 19 early in the second. Bearcats starting to chip away, though. Marlon Beck not playing like a freshman tonight. BU pulls within five to, with under five to play. Not much later, Nick Madre misses the layup but gets his own mess and puts it in. Down three with three to play. Pressure is on. Then it's Beck again. And a three again. He had six threes on the night, 27 points. Lead is down to two for Cornell after a Jordan Reed and one gives the Bearcats the lead. Their first of the game, it's Beck one more time. The three puts the Bearcats up five. They pull away from there, 89 to 79. Bearcats come back to top the Big Red. Quite a big first win of the season. A former Syracuse player beginning a journey of his own. SU basketball alumni Chris Joseph taking his talents to France, the six foot seven forward signed to start his professional career overseas in the Pro A League in France. The transition shouldn't be too tough for Joseph. He's from Montreal and already speaks fluently in French. Joseph went to training camp with the NBA's Orlando Magic, but the team cut him before the start of the regular season. Prior to that, he split his time between the Boston Celtics and Brooklyn Nets.